all versus rise of my soul family now let me tell you something soul family a lot of these racist europeans in the western countries like usa united kingdom and canada they have been hating on afro hair caribbean african melanated people for so long when they see these melanated non-ether copper skin indigo african caribbean melanated beings wearing this afro hair that sticks up like electricity that, that's so connected to the sun, like a tree, like a plant. These racist Europeans in these Western countries, they hate, they hate that. Because a lot of racist Europeans, they truly hate a lot of melanated non-ether, aka infinite ether, copper skin, indigo skin, melanated people who wears that Afro hair that sticks up like static shock. Like for real, bro. Like, Racist European people wish they could do this. Like, really. These racist Europeans wish they could do that. They wish they could do this with their hair. You know, when a lot of these racist European slave owners, these racist European white supremacists, when they wash their hair, their hair is literally looking like a canine. A, a canine that just took a bath. That's, what, that's how a lot of these racist, jealous, envious, hateful ass European white supremacists feel when they wash their hair those racist Europeans their hair literally looks like a canine that just took a bath when we melanated people wash our hair our bro look look at all that look at all that come on man come on bro when we melanated people wash our hair and shit, come on, bro. When we melanated people wash our hair, our hair literally absorbs the water. You racist European people, they be mad at that and wishing that they had Afro hair that is of the non ether, infinite ether beings of this multiverse. That's why a lot of these racist European white supremacists, when they see Afro hair melanated people, they wanted a lot of us afro hair non ether beings to cut our hair to have us hate ourselves man that stuff is so crazy and another thing too you notice how like when it comes to middle eastern people they don't got to worry about racist comments saying like how about you wear a hat when you go into a store because a lot of you afro hair people especially my africans and my caribbean melanated people that have afro hair you get told racist comments, even by your own melanated relatives who grew up in the Western countries like USA. Because I tell you, a lot of my relatives in the Western countries, you know, when I was going to a store, they'd be like, how about you put a hat over your head? And I was like, man, bro, my own my own biological relatives made a racist comment to say me, I wear a hat over my head just so I don't just so my light doesn't shine and, and irritate these racist white supremacists in USA. I'm like, bro, like let these racist Europeans show their real racist nature towards Afro haired non ether beings. Like if I go into a store and my hair is sticking up like static shock, like let it so be. Let it so be. Let these racist white supremacists be mad at Afro haired people. They've been doing that since slavery and even before slavery, especially when pharaohs existed, especially when the Orishas knew of these afro hair melanated people. Like there's so many afro hair melanated people in different planets in this multiverse. You would you wouldn't even begin to you wouldn't be able to begin to imagine how so many powerful melanated beings with this afro hair, the Atlantis race people, the the damn melanated Saiyans, the melanated Orishas, the all these different melanated species, the melanated Izodians, bro. And a lot of these racist Europeans of planet Earth who are a part of white supremacy. They want to hate us afro hair melanated people that are not ether beings. For what? Just because it literally irritates their whole insecurities of not having afro hair and their hair looks like a canine. Like what, what could they possibly do about that? You know? Now, when it comes to these, when it comes to these tan beige skinned people that look European, but they're not from planet Earth, they the only, they the only Caucasian skinned humanoid extraterrestrials that actually appreciate these melanated non-ether beings. 
such as these Palladians, these Umites, these Argentine, Caucasian skin, humanoid extraterrestrials, they the only one who like us. But as far as these racist European white supremacists, they feel with so much hate in their spirit, they can't appreciate these Afro hair melanated people, especially in USA, especially in the Southern states like Mississippi, Florida, Georgia, Louisiana, Arkansas. We don't know what it is with these racist European white supremacy rednecks. For some reason, they just hate Afro hair people. It might have something to do with the non ether beings of ancient history. You know, being being the most spiritually intelligent beings because melanated people's hair makes them more spiritually intelligent the more they grow it, right? These are all facts because the more I grew my hair, I became more spiritually intelligent in a lot of things. I was more aware of my surroundings, more like in tune with my intuition versus where my hair was always cut. You know, I noticed like the more I grew my hair, the more that lighter skinned people started to hate me because... I'm a dark skin melanated not either being growing this afro hair so it's like bro like we already know these racist european white supremacist rednecks like they gonna continue to hate us melanated people with this afro hair like it's just it's just in their blood system man it's just in their blood system and there's, there's another thing too you notice how a lot of these racist european rednecks you know those police officers they be having these receding hairlines looking like pigs and shit and they be big mad they be mad tight they be mad tight that we melanated beings that got this afro hair we could put it into locks we could put it in ponytails we could do anything with it that they cannot do and they be mad they be big mad they be mad tight and i'm like man don't 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 even don't even blame us because we got different genetics from you you know it's crazy man but for the light but for these caucasian skin humanoid extraterrestrials out there that appreciate us non-ether melanated skin afro hair beings salute to you but you racist europeans of planet earth we don't know what your problem is you racist european white supremacy rednecks came all the way from a european country to like fucking have melanated African Caribbean slaves cut their hair because you knew that these African and Caribbean Afro hair people had so much spiritual power within their hair. So you made them cut their hair to fit inside the school system. They did this stuff with my family relatives with the males. And you know, it's all facts, man. Do you know like a lot of the most spiritually intelligent melanated people on the planet have have a lot of hair to the point their hair is down to their ankles we could talk about that and a lot of these european racist white supremacists they hate melanated people that have super long hair that sits all the way down to their ankles looking like raddits from dragon ball z yeah raddits the sands are melanated people you could put a pitchfork inside their hair raddits melanated He's straight up melanated. And a lot of these racist Europeans, they hate melanated people so much they had to make the sands be Caucasian skin. Because they didn't want they didn't want people to know that melanated non ether beings are powerful beings. They do this all the time. But hey, like that's all I gotta say about how powerful melanated not ether beings hair is and how jealous a lot of these white supremacy rednecks are. And if you are a Afro hair melanated not ether being living in these Western countries, whether it's United Kingdom, Canada, or you or USA, you know these racist rednecks, man, they be kicking the air every time they see a melanated person, especially if you are a dark skinned melanated male with afro hair, whether you have it in locks or an afro or a ponytail or braids your hair is super long your hair is connected to the sun it's sticking up like electricity like the ninjas from the lightning village in naruto yeah a lot of these racist rednecks they they kick in the air they wish they had your spiritual intuitional powers with that afro hair and you racist europeans you can stay mad and be mad tight for a long time